What's up, cutie? It's me, Miss T, and thanks for checking out the answer key. Today, I want to talk to you guys about two things that I've been using lately that I have been looking for and needing. And frankly, I'm really excited about it because it works great. See that? A Venotoxic Radiant Daily Cleansing Pads. You guys, I'm just going to tell you straight out. This jar was about $7 and some change. However, the product is awesome. And depending on how bougie you are about your face products, that may be cheap, <laughs> that may be expensive to you. It depends, but I will tell you, it's worth it. It really is. There's 28 pads in here. And low-key, I cut those bad boys in half. Sure do. <laughs> and they still work great. A little goes a long way. They soak these things. I mean, when I tell you it's soaked, it's soaked. Like, it's drippy. Okay. They're so good. Let me just show you what it looks like. That's the soft side. And this is the scrubby side. Okay. Look, look. I'm going to have to wash my hands. It is soaked in suds of awesomeness. The product smells so good, so clean. I wish we had smell of vision because it smells great. It goes on smooth. You feel like your face is completely clean but not stripped i do not walk away ever feeling like like i can't move my face because it's so stripped of everything delicious okay this stuff right here i'm telling you i use it daily and it says it has five factors of radiance Okay, now let me tell, let me let's before we get into all that, let me be very clear. This is not for if you have like a, a bad acne issue. I wouldn't use this. It's very gentle. It's very gentle. But if you are just trying to get your face clean as a whistle, okay, you just want to be refreshed in the morning. You don't want to smell like medication or anything it's very light it's very gentle and if you need to use the scrub inside I don't even use the scrubber part every day I don't use it every day I don't need it every day I'm just not that busy with my face so the one side works great it foams up like that okay you add a little bit of water to it I wet my face first and just glide it over, glide it over my face, glide it all over my neck. Um, and then on days when I do feel like I need to like get into my pores, you know, I may have had makeup on or something um, a few times that week. And I can see, you know, when you wear makeup a few times, you can like see the huge difference in your face after a few days. Because even when you wash it off, there's still like a little bit left behind. Like you know it's there, but it's not there there. But um, yes, yeah, so I've been using these and they are so great. It has, uh, it says gently exfoliates to reveal skin's natural radiance with moisture rich soy extract. Um, it, it, it does the job. It really does the job. And I, when I tell you, like, after I use it, you it's like immediate. You can see, like, your face is just brighter. It looks like refreshed. Like somebody took a big bucket of water and <laughs> threw it in your face. And you just dabbed it off gently. Okay? It is so great. So awesome and a lot. Well, there's a lot of solution in here. They are not skimping 
on the solution and Avino is good like that I mean the brand just across the board I have not been disappointed generally with Avino when I try their products I've definitely used some of their baby products on my kids and they work great as well now here's what I will tell you about Avino I would not mix it with other things uh, I do follow up obviously after I rinse this off thoroughly and I do like a double rinse like I do a warm rinse and then I follow it up with some cold water to make sure my pores close up okay but um man it works so good it works so well I really really like it I really really do I mean I was I was pleasantly surprised I am very particular about what I put on my face I don't use everything and my face has changed over the years it seems like the older I get the more sensitive my skin is I can't just put any old thing on my face or I will break out and that's happened to me using other products that were a little too harsh so if you need something that's like a gentle cleaner cleanser for your face definitely check these pads out check them out um it's worth the investment to me i think like i said i cut them in half so they do go a long way for me now in addition to these cleansing pads i also got this avino positively radiant 60 second in shower facial okay oh, can you see it? Mm -hmm. I hope you can see the front but that's what it's called okay and again I get in there warm water on my face two sizes of a pea and I'll show you what it looks like just so you can get okay that's the cream but it does have like you know you can feel the, that texture in it but it's not too rough you're not scrubbing the bottom of your feet after a long day you're scrubbing your face so if you want something that is gentle and again it smells so I wish you could smell it it smells so good it just smells clean and fresh and light it doesn't have a lot of um, like a like a harsh perfumey smell it's something in it there's something in it you can smell something but it's not very like super perfumey uh this is oil free non-drying which is key for me because i definitely have gotten in the shower used something else got out and just one of those nights you just nose dive in the bed you don't have 10 minutes to you know find your cream for your face find your lotion for your body or your vaseline or your oil or whatever it is that you use you're just trying to get clean and get in the bed well i have used this and literally gone to bed no harm no foul i don't feel like i'm my face is gonna crack like glass because it's so dry it's it's moisturizing it's really great and this right here like i said i put it on and I'll just like, you know, do my circular motions around my face and my neck, leave it on, do everything else I have to do, and um, rinse it off. That's it. And then I run run it back with the cold water to make sure my pores are closed. Um, but I love this. I really do. And it says it is the positively radiant is a collection okay as five factors of radiance tone texture dullness blotchiness and brown spots to leave your skin looking fresh awake and luminous now i have had some bouts with breakouts i don't have super bad acne you know not since i was like a child but i've had some moments and i don't know if it was something i ate or something that I used on my face but I have had some moments and I've had blotchiness and I've had 
dark spot, spots and, and spots on my face here and there that'll just show up. And I'm like, where did you come from and why are you here? What's going on? <laughs> we have to get this together. It evens your tone. It definitely helps it get that even, smooth, you know, you, does she have on makeup? That kind of look. You're glowing. You definitely, like, can see the difference. I certainly can. Like, after maybe, definitely not overnight. It wasn't like when I used this. Like, I used it, woke up the next day and was like, oh, Miss T. <laughs> okay. All right. We're here for that. This right here, after about a week, say it was about a week, I was able to literally see like some of the little dark spots that I had, those blemishes were fading. Now, I don't remember exactly how much this costs, um, but whatever it was, it wasn't that crazy. I want to say it might have been like five bucks or something online, um, but it really wasn't anything to like get shocked about and for it to be that inexpensive and work as well as it does it's like Avino how are y'all doing that how because a lot of products I've tried that are way more expensive way more expensive they just don't work as well these two <laughs> I'm telling you they work both of them they work really well. Again, if you have an acne issue, Aveeno Positively Radiant may not be strong enough for what you're going through. You may need something with a little more heat behind it. But if you're trying to get a gentle cleanse and a gentle exfoliation, these two will definitely get the job done. And what's so great about this in-shower situation is your two peas. You rub it in, in, you know, boom. You're not killing extra time before you get in the shower, after you get in the shower, trying to get this done. No, the, the same day that you use your body scrub, use this, okay? I don't use it daily. Definitely not daily. I don't even know, do they say to use it daily? One to two times a week, boom. So... <laughs> There you go. That's how I use it anyway. So yeah, just give it a try. Let me know what you think. I hope it works for you. If you found something super great that you're using currently, definitely let me know because I'm always down to find some new awesomeness to put on the countertop. So at any rate, I just wanted to let you guys know about these two awesome finds that I found in your regular Walgreens CVS wherever you go to get your store products you can buy it online I mean you literally it's a vino you can find it pretty much anywhere um so at any rate the one thing I haven't tried is their moisturizer I haven't tried the moisturizer because I have a great moisturizer that I've been using unfortunately the person that I get it from is no longer in business. So there's that. So if you know of a great moisturizer, put it down in the comments. I'd love to hear about it because I'm definitely in the market for a new daily moisturizer. So with that being said, I hope you've had an amazing day. Thanks so much for tuning in and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you. Like, subscribe, and comment down below. I want to hear from you. Okay. Take care. See you soon. Bye.